Welcome to GED exam practice test. Our topic today is science. Use the link in the description to download the app on the App Store for free practice tests. Number 1. As temperature rises, solids generally become more soluble in water, but gases become less soluble. If a soft drink contains high concentrations of sugar and carbon dioxide, which of the following may be expected to happen if it is cooled down? A. Gas bubbles may form and produce foam. B. Sugar may precipitate out. C. Water may evaporate rapidly. The correct answer is B. Sugar may precipitate out. Number 2. The Smiths have four children, all girls. Their fifth child is a boy. Why did this change occur? A. The conception class is taken by the parents. B. The timing of the fertility cycles. C. The mother's contribution of a Y chromosome. D. The father's contribution of a Y chromosome. The correct answer is D. The father's contribution of a Y chromosome. Number 3. Air is composed of nitrogen, oxygen, argon, carbon dioxide, and other gases. How may air be best described? A. A mixture. B. A compound. C. A solution. D. An alloy. The correct answer is A. A mixture. Number 4. Table salt sodium chloride, one of the most common substances occurring in nature, is best classified as which of the following? A. A mixture. B. A compound. C. A solution. D. An alloy. The correct answer is B. A compound. Number 5. According to Newton's laws of motion, an object set in motion remains in motion, unless a force acts on it. If you suspend an object from a string and make it swing, the object will swing for a while, then slow down and stop. Why does the suspended object stop swinging? A. Because an object at rest remains at rest, unless a force acts upon it. B. Because the mass of the object is too small to maintain the motion. C. Because energy of motion is converted to heat through friction with air. D. Because energy is the ability to do work. The correct answer is C. Because energy of motion is converted to heat through friction with air. Number 6. In an exothermic process, heat is released by the process to the surroundings. An example of an exothermic process is burning wood. An endothermic process requires the input of heat from the surroundings. An example of an endothermic process is boiling water. Which of the following is an endothermic process? A. Detonation of an explosive. B. Melting ice. C. Burning paper. D. The formation of helium in the sun. The correct answer is B. Melting ice. Number 7. Why does ice float on water? A. Because ice is less dense than water. B. Because water conducts heat better than ice. C. Because ice has a lower temperature. D. Because heat from the Earth's core travels upward, cooling the bottom first. The correct answer is A. Because ice is less dense than water. Number 8. Which of the following is not true about gravity? A. The more massive two objects are, the greater the gravitational force between them. B. Gravitational force between two objects depends on the distance between them. C. Gravitational force between two objects depends only on the mass of the larger object. D. People can jump higher on the moon than on Earth because the gravitational force between a person and the moon is lower than the gravitational force between a person and the Earth. The correct answer is C. Gravitational force between two objects depends only on the mass of the larger object. Number 9. Change of phase is a process whereby matter changes form, solid, liquid, gas. Which one of the following constitutes a phase change? A. Photosynthesis. B. Digestion of food. C. Dry cleaning. D. Condensation of water vapor.
The correct answer is decondensation of water vapor. Number 10. Which statement about energy and or matter is incorrect? A. Matter and energy can't be created. B. All matter tends toward more disordered states. C. Matter and energy can't be destroyed. D. Heat energy is composed of heat atoms. The correct answer is D. Heat energy is composed of heat atoms. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel for updated videos every week.